Let's start this problem by drawing a free body diagram for the first hanging mass M1. Again, usual technique, ask yourself what forces are acting on that mass. There's the force of gravity acting downwards, that's M1g, and there's the tension in the string acting upwards, T. Now the free body diagram for the other mass, M2. Similar situation, we have the force of gravity acting downwards, M2g in this case, and the, tens the tension in the string acting upwards. Right, notice that in this problem we're going to take the upward direction as positive. So if the acceleration of M1 is A, then the acceleration of M2 must be minus A, as shown by the purple arrows on the diagram. Right, the next stage is to write down our equations of motion. We only need to consider motion in the vertical direction here because there's no acceleration in the horizontal direction. So for the mass um, m1, then the equation of motion is t minus m1g is equal to m1a. So the resultant force on the mass m1 is just the tension minus the force of gravity, and that's substituted into Newton's second law, so that on the right-hand side of the equation you have m1a. Now, the equation of motion for mass m2, again on the left-hand side of the equation there, t minus m2g, that's the resultant force, substituted into Newton's second law, gives us on the right-hand side, minus m2a. The minus sign there because the acceleration is in the opposite direction for this block. We now subtract equation 2 from equation 1, which gives us this expression, minus m1g plus m2g is equal to m1a plus m2a. And transposing that equation gives us this expression for the acceleration, which is m2 minus m1g divided by m1 plus m2. Substituting that back in to equation 1 gives us an expression for the tension in the string, which is shown on the screen as m1 into m2 minus m1g divided by m1 plus m2, and then just plus m1g. Transposing that equation further gives us finally 2m1 m2g divided by m1 plus m2. Again, let's put some numbers in now. We have M1 equal to, say, 150 kilograms and M2 equal to 200 kilograms. That will give us a value for our acceleration of 1.40 meters per second squared and a value for the tension in the string of 1,682 newtons.